Hello, you are welcome to solve this math problem by simplifying cube root of square root of 5 plus 2 minus cube root of square root of 5 minus 2. So in the first step, this whole expression will let as x. So it will be x is equal to this expression. So we'll simplify this expression so as you can find the value of x. Then in the next step, it will be x is equal to this cube root we let as a. So it will be a then minus this cube root we let as b. Then in the next step, because here we have cube root, cube root, we will power by 3 in both sides. So it will be x power 3 is equal to this a minus b bracket power 3. Then it will be x power 3 is equal to the, the expansion of a minus b bracket power 3. It is a power 3 minus 3a square b plus 3ab square then minus b power 3. Then it will be x power 3 is equal to a power 3 minus b power 3. Then in here and here, negative, we take negative 3ab out of bracket. Then this divided by this, it is a. This divided by this, it is minus b bracket. Then in the next step, it will be x power 3 is equal to, we substitute from here a power 3, we substitute the value of a, whereas before we let a, it is this cube root of square root of 5 plus 2. So from here a, it is cube root of square root of 5 plus 2. Then bracket this power of 3. Then minus b power of 3, it will be minus b. Here b will let before it is cube root of square root of 5 minus 2. So here it will be cube root of square root of 5 minus 2. Then bracket this power of 3 then minus 3ab so here to be minus 3ab then here inside the bracket a minus b a minus b it is x so into here it will be times x then in the next step because we don't know this a times b so we'll calculate here a times b is equal to a it is this times b it is this so a it will be here a bracket cube root of square root of 5 plus 2 bracket then times b it will be here times bracket cube root of square root of 5 minus 2 bracket then in the next step it will be a b is equal to this cube root here will have common cube root. So it will be cube root of this expression in under the cube root times this expression under the cube root. So it will be square root of 5 plus 2 bracket times square root of 5 minus 2 bracket. Then it will be a, b is equal to cube root of square root of 5 times square root of 5, it is 5. Square root of 5 times negative 2, it is negative 2 square root of 5. Then positive 2 times square root of 5, it will be plus 2 square root of 5. 2 times negative 2, it will be negative 4. Then it will be a, b is equal to cube root of this 2 square root of 5 minus 2 square root of 5 is 0. So this and this will cancel. Then it will be 5 minus 4, it is 1. So it will be equal to cube root of 1, it is 1. So into here, AB will substitute this 1. Then it will be this x power 3. So here it will be x power 3 is equal to into here, this cube root will cancel with this power of 3. So it will be square root of 5 plus 2. 
so here is square root of 5 plus 2 then minus this cube root will cancel with this power of 3 so it will be minus here then bracket this expression under the cube root which is square root of 5 minus 2 so here it is square root of 5 minus 2 bracket then minus 3 a b a b it is this one so it will be 3 times 1 times x which is it will be minus here 3 times 1 times x it is 3 x then in the next step it will be x power 3 is equal to square root of 5 plus 2 we open the bracket by this negative to be negative square root of 5 plus 2 then minus 3x then it will be x power 3 is equal to this square root of 5 minus square root of 5 is 0 so this and this will cancel then it will be this which is minus 3x then plus 2 plus 2 it is 4 so it will be plus 4 then we we'll take this into the left side so it will be x power 3 this will take into this side it will be plus 3x 4 will take to this side it will be minus 4 is equal to 0 then to solve this cubic equation it is same as this here x power 3 we solve this by grouping and factorization so it will be x power 3 then plus 3x is same as plus 4x minus x then this minus 4 is equal to 0 then it will be x power 3 we start with this it will be minus x then plus 4x then minus 4 is equal to 0 then from here we take x out of bracket so this divided by this is x square this divided by this is minus 1 bracket then plus into here we take 4 out of bracket this divided by this is x this divided by this is minus 1 bracket is equal to 0 then it will be x into here x square minus 1 this is in the form of a perfect square so this is same as bracket x plus 1 bracket bracket x minus 1 bracket then plus this which is 4 bracket x minus 1 bracket is equal to 0 then from here x minus 1 is common so we take x minus 1 bracket out of bracket this divided by this it is this times this so it will be x bracket x plus 1 bracket then plus this divided by this it is 4 so it will be plus 4 bracket is equal to 0 then it will be this which is x minus 1 bracket bracket we take this x inside the bracket to be x times x is x square then plus x times 1 is x then plus 4 bracket is equal to 0 then from here we have two solutions whereas this is the first solution which is x minus 1 is equal to 0 and this is the second solution x square plus x plus 4 is equal to 0 then from the first solution we take negative 1 into the right side so it will be x is equal to 1 so this is the first value of x which is the real solution now to check if into this quadratic equation if it will give a real solution we'll use discriminant formula so from discriminant is equal to b square minus 4ac then it will be discriminant is equal to b square here b it is 1 so it will be 1 square minus 4 times a a is 1 times c c is 4 then it will be discriminant is equal to 1 square is 1 then minus 4 times 4 it is 16 then it will be discriminant is equal to 1 minus 16 it is negative 15 now this negative 15 it is less than 0 so if it is less than 0 than less than 0 then into this quadratic equation there is no real solution 
So the only real solution it is this x is equal to 1. Then we recall this before we are simplifying this. So we before we let this this expression as x. So from this expression it is equal to 1. So our conclusion from that expression which is cube root of square root of 5 plus 2 then minus cube root of square root of 5 minus 2 is equal to this which is 1. So this is the final answer of this our problem. Thank you for watching. Don't forget these steps to miss out. Subscribe to my channel and see you in the next video. Bye bye.